Hey everyone. Yep, I'm going all gangster on ya. Anyway, I said I ordered something special and it came in today. And I started opening it and I thought, they gotta see this. Because I am so excited. So this is what it is. It is Austin A I S I T I N solar pump water fountain with rotating nozzle. Um, had it shipped to the campground that I'm at, and I am. Um, I did pay twenty five dollars, not in my budget, but couldn't resist. So let's. And that's the reason I had bought this, and I bought this, and I bought some seashells, but I forgot that I won't be able to use it, um, the seashells, because it's a solar plate that goes in the water, not sits outside. So let's get the directions, tear the before using tear off protective cover and I'm not sure this I think we probably better read the instructions let me get my glasses okay I don't look good going gangster so we change hats and as you can see there's a storm moving in so it's probably not going to work so there's a diagram. This is A plus B plus E F. I have no idea what. Here's all these different. So I guess we're just going to start opening. Hmm. Totally confused. It says protective covering. I don't know if there's something that's supposed to be peeled off. I have no idea. Okay. So we're going to try, I don't know. I'll try this one. It looks like a sprayer. Nope. Okay, this has got some big things in it. Ah, that looks more like... Okay. So it has... Okay, there's a protective cover. It's just a ring that was on the back of it. Got that much figured out. I can feel it working, and there's not much sun. I'm not a patient person. Okay, so I found this little diagram to see if all the parts are there that I didn't pay any attention to. And then on the back side is this little diagram that shows you A, B, C. So, A is the solar round thing. This is B that goes in next. And then, it's done because they don't have them together. And then, C. Okay, these instructions suck. But, they got two um, insulation process. And I'm thinking this, I'm going to do the taller one because it requires more parts. So it must be if you want a t taller spray, which I do, or you can just keep it low right to it so it's a, like a bubbler. So I am going to build this up tall. Okay, I'm figuring out it's just easier to do on my own. So I'm going to take that one video. I just figured it out. So there's one, two, three, four, five parts to that. I think they could have made it easier, but... And I got the one with the most sprays. 
So I don't think there's going to be enough light to set this off, but we're going to set it outside for a little bit. Okay, so here are these little legs to hold it in place. Let me make sure I don't break them. Does it pull out? Okay. They do have little arrows that shows you where to pull out, which is good. So this will hold it in place. It will run in three inches of water. So next part is to, oh, I, I can hear them snap into place. Okay, let's get some water going, see if we get enough sunlight. Well, we can't get electrocuted because no electricity. That's a good thing, right? And I'm assuming you can just dump water on it because it's going to be outside. Okay, it's floating. Ah, look at it. It's working. You can't probably see because of the splashes. Yay. It is floating. Oh, that's cute. So I did want it for yard. I didn't really want tabletop. But I think we're going to leave it sit here and see how it does. Now, dummy me, I bought these beautiful little rocks and some seashells because I was going to put them in here. Um, but that plate has to um, get sunshine. Listen. Okay, so I might as well show you what I do now that I'm set up for a long period of time to give myself more space if it's going to rain. So this here is a shower curtain. Ocean themed, of course. It's a breeze. And here's what it looks like. So up here, oh, this come on, but this is a mesh thing. So what I've got is Clippy, a plastic shower curtain, beach themed, so they can see me from an airplane. And I've just got it Clippy in each corner. And then... Since that's so close to my door, I put that shower curtain up. I did this last time it rained. I was able to sit out here and have extra living space. And then, when I'm sitting here on my deck, which is right there, I think I'm going to leave that little table there with my fountain so I can see it at night and listen to the water run. Okay, maybe I'm happier with that than I thought I was. We will look at it tonight 
Um, hopefully it's going to get enough sunlight yet that it will start um, showing light when it gets dark. Different colors. You know how to put this together was easier than figuring out my water fountain. So that's tied down. The only thing is I can't get the zipper. Probably because it's never been used. And then you just Velcro. This here. And my windshield, I don't know if you can see, just snaps in, you can take it down to a half a windshield or a full windshield. have one on it so that's gonna flap more than I want it to we're gonna see if we can get it settled up okay I hope you can see this the other thing that I am responsible for is checking the oil and here's the engine so that little red thing there you check it just like you do a car and then there's the gas tank um, it's half full so Friday um, I will go fill it back up and I'll take it along for that and that's all the responsibility I have maintenance takes care of anything that I ask them that you know needs help something else we need to get done today is get the electric heater out. It's supposed to be 59 degrees tonight, and since it's gonna be raining, it's gonna be chilly. Last night wasn't bad, I still had my windows down. Uh, my big one a little bit, and then my back little pop-out windows. I got cold, but I just put blankets on me because I'm too lazy to actually get up and roll them up. So, that's something else. And if it does get non-cloudy later, we may take that golf cart down to the boat ramp um, and scrub it with the rest of the window coverings down there. Um, it'd be a little bit easier. I just want to make sure I don't get wet. Well, look at that. I have all my ducks in a row. Well, just remember, explore, travel, stay fantastic. Talk to you soon. Bye.